Commencing restart in three, two, one. Start looking! We're in. Nice. Now you just gotta climb to the top of the tower and align the dish with WKZ. Say what now? He's making a joke. The elevator's already on its way down. Thanks, Josh. I'm guessing you jumped out of planes before, right? Man, I've crashed a plane. Have you been mountain climbing? Of course. Running with the bulls. Oh, fuck no. <laughs> there, there it is. What is it with you and animals? Man, fuck animals. We are at war with all of them. They're all evolving to replace us on the food chain, you know. The less they know about us, the better. Wait, even puppies? Man, especially goddamn puppies. They've infiltrated our society, you know. They're learning what we are. <laughs> Shit. Yo, we getting you a puppy. Hey, don't make me the guy that kicks a puppy, Marcus. I don't want to be that guy. Should be good to go. I'll just add the finishing touches and... There. Looks good. Josh and I are on our way. Oh, bring the air. Hey, nice view. Yeah, I noticed. Fly like foot. And now to watch that sweet, sweet burn. Sure you configured it properly? Dude, I don't question you about crypto shit, do I? Guys, shut up. I'm in. Here with the CEO of Home, who I'm told has a lot of Always got a surprise for them, alright. 
I brought our newest device with me, and I'm happy to announce the launch of Home 2.0. Hell yeah! Yes. Just a simple yes. push of a button. <laughs> That's what? the DeadSec logo. Oh, I'm sorry. Would you oh care to comment God. on that? Oh, my God. Nice! Turn it off. We're done. We're done here. We're done. Citizens of the digital age, welcome. Come, come. Home thought they could fool you. Ooh. They sold you a system to monitor your homes, promising privacy, security, and convenience. Home is selling your habits. habits. In fact, you pay a monthly subscription fee for the privilege of being sold to the highest bidder. It's time to wake up. Reclaim the value inherent to who you are. If you don't control that information, someone else will. You can pray our corporations treat you favorably, or you can take matters into your own hands. DedSec has given you the truth. Do what you will. That was humiliating! Steven, Steven! Steven. You took a bad beat, buddy. It happens. Listen to me, you smart son of a bitch! You promise! Not your smartest move, Steven. You've had some monumental fuck-ups recently. Sit down. Dude, I gave you the means to, you know, be proactive with all that data. And you screwed the pooch on fucking television, dude. Somebody's probably doing an auto-tune of your interview right now. Don't go near DedSec. They're my responsibility. All you need to do is figure out an apology to my lawyers for laying your hands on me. You gonna be okay? You gonna be okay? Say yes. There you go. I'm gonna get you a glass of water. Marcus, you need to get back here right now. What's going on? Nothing good. Ow. Hurry. Now! Help! Somebody's getting carjacked! Shit, 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 Hey, man, shit, what's, what, hey, what's going on? I was looking at our numbers, how many people downloaded our app, how much processing power we had available, and that's when I saw it. It, what, it, what? 
chunk of our followers and bots came from inactive or dead invite accounts. Hey, wait, so someone used a social media site to boost our numbers? Who? And how many fucking accounts, I don't man? know who, but it came from inside invite. Someone with admin access, I'm sure of that. As for how many... Fuck Sorry. Me. Sorry, I didn't check. It's... No, it's all my fault. I didn't check. Josh, no, I didn't it's check. You no, know, maybe someone inside invite is a fan. Yeah, or maybe we're getting set up to get fucked. Check. Check. We need to find out. Marcus, find your way inside. I should have just checked. Josh, checked. Josh, it's not your fault, okay? Look, we all saw the numbers. You're the only one who caught it. You did good. You did good. Huh? Francisco group of hackers has exposed New Dawn's religious secrets. DedSec revealed footage of New Dawn's temple area and demonstrated that the so-called ancient artifacts were simply fakes of what New Dawn claimed were ancient tablets. Members of the hacker group managed to infiltrate the highly guarded compound and capture the secretive organization's methods of control over members, including movie star Jimmy Siska. New Dawn declined our requests for an interview. Sending you the flagged accounts. Use the CEO's computer, Mary Catskill. She's on vacation, so her office should be empty. I unlocked the elevator. Heading there now. Heading up. I'm gonna get us some answers. Good luck, Marcus. We're with you. I'm in. Trying to figure out who boosted our numbers. Whoa, whoa. What happened? The flag clients just vanished. We lost the bots. What did you do? Nothing. This isn't me. I...
Marcus, is this a bad time? Sort of feels like a bad time. And she drinks it with ice. I don't really need to introduce myself, do I? I know who you are. That night at the beach, man, I knew you looked fucking familiar. You well, know, Venus must have been in retrograde or some bullshit because I think it was fate that I was in the night that you hacked into our system. I had to meet you, and there you were, pissing on your sneakers. All brains and no aim. What's Bloom's CTO doing in the office of the CEO of Invite? And why'd you boost our numbers? Uh, this is the part where you offer me a six-figure salary? <laughs> no, fuck no. No, no, no. You could coat circles around most of my programmers. No, see, I can't pitch uh, CTOS 2.0 as a state-of-the-art security system and then hire someone that's on the no-fly list. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I just came here to have a drink. But hey, if you want to have a drink and a dance, I meant. Oh, you think it's a fucking joke? Huh? Do it. Roll a fucking punch. <laughs> you got everybody eating out your fucking hands thinking the system's bulletproof? You can't see the people you're stepping on. Guess what, Marcus? Guess what? The people want to be told who is good and who is bad. They don't care how it works, only that it does. But it doesn't fucking work. A few fucking civilian casualties is the cost you have to pay for the betterment of the world. You're fighting a war no one gives a shit about. Now they're just swimming upstream right into the grizzly's mouth. So why'd you prop up dead sex numbers? There's no one in Silicon Valley could throw a proper punch. That, and you're a great investment. You're so aggressive, so indignant. You frightened the rest of Silicon Valley right to my doorstep. You used us to sell CTOS 2.0 to them. It was the ultimate deterrent against hackers like you. And now, everyone needs my protection. So, here it is, Marcus. Your record is back on file. Your backdoor access is plugged. And those bots I gave you, you're gone. Oh, 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 and there's a warrant out for your arrest. For hacking, corporate espionage, and breaking and entering. It's okay. I was done with it anyway. Fuck. I got played. Fuck. 
cops are surrounding the building. Get out of there. Fuck! Marcus, they're surrounding the building. Get pissed later and get out now! I repeat, come out with your hands up! Alright, alright, I'm... I'm gone. Doesn't have to end bad. Dispatch, been dispatched after the suspect. Uh. Officer D. Phil. EMF, take them. Squad, we're hearing gunshots. We'll investigate. I got played. Fuck! Cops are surrounding the building. Get out of there. Fuck! Marcus, they're surrounding the building. Get pissed later and get out now! I repeat, come out with your hands up! Alright, alright, I'm... I'm gone. Marcus, it's getting too hot out there for you. Come back. We'll figure this out together. It's not that bad. We look like a bunch of chumps. God fucking damn it! Wrench, calm the fuck down. It's not helping. Yeah, you're right. It's not helping. Marcus, you got anything to say? Well, guys, I, to be honest with you, uh, I genuinely don't have a plan. But I got an idea, and... I don't know, just trust me on this one. Here we go! Oh, good for you, Ren! 
lunch. I know things haven't been great lately. Yeah, <laughs> they've sucked. But whatever shit we're in now, that's now. You helped us find our voice. We took on the Giants and had one motherfucker of a run. Never thanked you for any of it. Hey, why are you talking like it's over? Isn't it? I'm still in. I know you are, and we can convince the others that you're not in. These are from our DeadSec channels. DeadSec is not worthy. DeadSec is a bunch of skiddies. You told us lies and bullshit. Hashtag dead suck. Yeah, so we got some shit stirrers. Who cares what they think? Who cares what they... Jesus, Marcus. Have you been paying attention? I care what they think. I've worked my ass off for years, trying to earn us respect long before you ever showed up. This is my brand. Now it's completely fucked. So unfuck it. I don't know if I can. Uh, well, if it makes you feel any better, at least you're not a fugitive. <laughs> oh, damn. I wonder if there's a bounty on your head. Maybe I can salvage this. Oh, please. Hey, you couldn't catch me if you wanted oh, to. Oh, you're talking to a track star, bitch. Just walk. Yeah. Yeah. I don't want to hurt anything. Yeah, me neither. If I gotta drag their asses out to the middle of the desert to keep DeadSec together, I'm gonna do it. DeadSec's come too far to give up now. Swelter Skelter's third annual Jabberwock Hacking Challenge begins soon at the Center Sculpture. Come show us what you got. Josh, who's your friend? Oh, this is Susan. She's a second grade teacher from Milwaukee. She's 32 and she drives a cherry red. Cool. Hey, we're gonna meet by the big sculpture for a group shot before the challenge. Um, whenever you're ready. Didn't mean to, uh, step on your game here. Game? Uh, we're not playing a game. I was just explaining to Susan how if your low speed mixture adjustment is too rich, your engine's going to buckle under all the excess fuel. That's a four cycle idle and that can be a no no. Yep, sh sure can. Okay, well, I'll see you out there. Leaving your mark? Always. But not dead sex. Doesn't feel right, you know? Come on, don't bum me out here. I'm trying to have a good time. Me too. So we, as in dead sex we, are gonna enter that hacking challenge and we're gonna win. And the others are okay with this? They will be. I got a nice smile. Well, you do have a nice smile. <laughs> See? No problem. We're gonna do this. Everything's gonna be okay. You've got it all figured out, huh? Nah. But I do know if I get you back in Satara mode, you'll figure out most of it for me. <laughs> Damn. You are dangerous. <laughs> Meet us by the ugly sculpture when you're ready. All right. See you there. Hey man, what you working on? Gonna get these people moving. But they need a proper track list. This shit barely has a pulse. DJ ratio. Just ratio. Back when I used to do sets. Hey, maybe I'll go back to it. What else am I gonna do now? Man, dead sex not over. We hit a pothole, that's all. We're gonna come back stronger. You're always so sure of yourself. I know. But I'm always right. Wait, wait, wait. Here we go. Ah, uh, yeah, that's much better. Lock their DJ out of his tools, too. The savior of the party. Hey, once you're done giving these guys a hard time, meet me in the middle. Dead sex entering a competition. I'll be there.
This isn't a fair fight. Oh, it's so not fair. Little guy's gonna get the shit kicked out of him. But that's what makes it fun, right? You like to watch a little guy take his lumps. Yeah. I mean, so he can get back up on his feet again and overcome, right? You're trying to turn this into a metaphor for dead set, aren't you? I mean, if you want to keep Deadset going, I'm right there with you. But if you're putting your metaphor money on that weirdo, no. He's going down and staying down. <laughs> yeah, it's a long shot. Hey, are you joining us for the competition? Yep, I'm down. That's us. All right, people, gather up. We need a group shot. Hey, try to look pretty for the camera, huh? Always. OK, looks like the challenge is starting. Hey, Josh, get on the numbers and feed it answers. Wrench, you got the jabber walk. Get it wired up and ready. Ratio, I need you to run interference on arrivals. Slow them down. Sitar and I are going to hack this thing. <laughs> Let's get it. Dead set. Let's go, guys. Drone's up there if you need a better view. Almost there. I'm inside. Okay, what is this? <laughs> nice! Throwing up the horns and punctuating them. We should focus. There seems to be a timer. Think you can hack it? Of course. Stop fucking moving! Don't mess with Zatara. Ah. Hey, you kids want to feed your heads? Two ounces of sacrosanct mindfuck. Man, man, man. People, I am going offline now. See you on the other side. Oh, Horatio, you good, man? The word good has lost all meaning, my friend. Mm. Okay, you good? Mm. Did I forget to mention that these boomers had a little acid bath? Uh, Josh? It's okay, they're using hallucinogens in clinical trials for... Mass bees. Mass... Mass bees. <laughs> Josh is feeling it. Okay, let's go find something for you to stare at. Huh? <laughs> okay. Okay. My... You're not Ray. You're Ray, Raymond Kinney Ray. I, I still got your old hacker zines, man. 
I remember reading War Driver and gearing up my 10 speed, backpack with an antenna. Shit, I even used your old root kit, man. Fuckster? Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> well, I assumed you were all just skitty pests. Correct me if I'm wrong, but your crew seems to have a lot of unfocused noise. You the leader? The fan world. Uh, no, nah, man, it doesn't work like that. Dead sex got a rule. No personal armies, no leaders. Yeah. Well, FYI, I saw you leading out nah, there. Man, this is everything we're fighting against. The system back home is completely fucked. And any kid out there on the sand is gonna say the exact same fucking thing. Easy words, bro, easy words. All right. A few years ago, this broken-ass system marked me as a criminal risk. Linked me to some shit I didn't even do because it was probable. And now, with CTOS, it's everywhere. I mean, I, I can see it down to the... <laughs> to the, to the sub subliminal shit. You just multiply. Yeah, we have a tendency to do that. What you call subliminal is a bellwether, Marcus. You got a sharp eye, kid. But subliminal is passive. Bellwether program is control. It's like a Orwell hooks with double punch. Profiling, media manipulation, corporate collusion, consumerism, all driven by predictive algorithms. And now, it's setting up shop in the heart of the Silicon Valley. And somebody at Bloom's using CTOS to feed it data. You're recruiting. I'm aching. Aching to give Bloom a swift steel kick in the peanut sack. Now I can help you kids up your game. Yeah. Help me slay the real Jabberwock. Walk with me, Marcus. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, shit. Whoa. Hey, Marcus, wake the fuck up. Let's what, go. man? Uh, I just spent the night in a pup tent next to a lady who was very nude and very tattooed. Oh, good for you, girl. No, you don't get it, man. She was the sons of Ragnarok bride. I guess we gotta go, man. We gotta fucking vamoose now. Come on. Fucking sons are coming. Oh, God. So you said you guys fucked up. How bad is it? Yeah, we all at risk now because my name's got a red flag on it. Yeah, people are gonna start making the connections. Yeah, where the fuck is everyone? Is that all? It's enough. We talking about Bloom here. Hey, and you're talking to Bloom's public enemy number one, son? Yeah, I've been dodging those bastards for years. If you want, I could scrub you from the system. Give me a couple hours. Just like that? Well, I might have to sacrifice a goat as part of my arcane ritual, but yeah, just like that. <laughs> there you are. We've been looking for you all morning. Turns out Swelter Skelter doesn't have a lost and found. <laughs> nah, it's more of a finder's keeper's policy out there in the desert. What in the hell is he doing here? Yeah, Marcus, why did you invite this stranger into our house? Look, look, it just happened, all right? We were running from these bikers, right? And... <laughs> Look, you know what? It doesn't even matter. He's cool. Oh, he's cool. Well, that's good. Because we usually discuss these things as a group. I know. It's my bad. But you met Ray already, right? I want to introduce you to Raymond Kinney. That's Raymond Kinney? I thought you'd be cleaner. 
Yeah, I get that a lot. Can I have a hug? Um, yeah, I have a two-second... I get this a lot, too. Can we keep him like a hacker in residence? Yeah, we could use his help. He should... He can, he, he can stay here, right? He should... He should stay here. Okay, fine. But if he fucks with any of us, I'm gonna pop his nuts like ripe grapes. Message received. Nice hat. Nice mask. Okay, we're good. You want a beer? Uh, yeah. I would love a beer. Or two. Oh, thank you. Grab the man some hardware, too. He's gonna teach us some magic. Hey, Marcus. One of our followers swept an email from a home student. Juicy shit, my friend. Hey, kid. Ready to change the world? I got something for you. Guys, I got a lead on a potential pedophile working for home. For fuck's sake. Big Brother's a sex offender? This is exactly why we went after home. So who is this guy? Cole something or other. I don't have a last name. We probably got an employee list from our home head. Let's see. Uh-huh. Cole Lang. I'll find him. Get some evidence. See what kind of person home is harboring. Marcus, what does home system look like to you? CTOS Junior. So it wouldn't surprise you to know that they've got a deal going on with Bloom. After what we just did to them? Yes. I bet all deals are off now. 
What were the terms? CTOS code is the base of home software. Collected data sold back to Bloom. At a hefty discount, of course. Sounds like we showed up at the right time, then. of smart houses in the Bay Area is facing allegations that it violated homeowner privacy. Leaked documents reveal that home is selling private user information, primarily to health insurance companies, by accessing their own monitoring system. Spokesperson for the company, Elena Chow, said that the information sold isn't in any way breaching users' privacy, and that all of this information is available on the company's end user license agreement.
Yeah, hold your horses. I'm looking through my kitty feeds now, man. Ladies and gentlemen, pervert Cole. Fucking menace. Let's wreck his world. Bath time. I got a never-ending supply. Okay, so when can we meet? Because I need something new for the weekend. Uh, prices are going up, Gris. This is exclusive material I'm providing. One customer, one kid. I don't know, man. Where'd you go? I'm right here. No, not you, Grizz. Do you have the footage or not? Yeah, yeah, no, everything's cool. Um, uh, <laughs> second thought, I got another kid in mind for you. Lost my fucking train of thought. You were talking about bankrupting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> ah, what the fuck are you doing, Grizz? I didn't do anything. Well, can you hear me? Yeah, I think that was on your end, man. Must be a bad connection. Um, okay, okay what was I saying? Something about screwing me. Fuck! God, oh, my footage! You mean my footage? Is it gone? No, Grizz, you'll get your vids. I just gotta call you back. What the fuck did I ever do to deserve this shit? Thousands of dollars down the drain. Snowflakes. Boys, no girls. Who, who's doing that? Bath time. Spies. Fuck spies on somebody! Boys, Get the fuck out of my house! Get the fuck! I'm gonna fucking find you! I'm gonna fucking what find you! What the hell are you doing, Cole? I I'm going! I'm going! Did you get all that? Yep. Jesus Christ. I wish I could reach through the camera and strangle that guy. Don't worry. This footage is already circulating. Society will do the strangling soon enough. Marcus, one of our latest followers sent me this. Consider it a follow-up on home CEO. Yo, check it. I was on the treadmill when this pissy-looking guy came up with a trainer and kicked me off. Dickhead looked familiar, so I asked around the gym. It was Steven Bader, the guy in charge of home. I guess waiting for a treadmill is too lowly for rich assholes like him. What would you guys think about shooting a little exercise fail video starring the CEO of home? Steven Bader? I'd love to have another go at humiliating that pompous ass. Why an exercise video? Peeping Steve is at the gym right now. Buckle in and get ready for a show, my friend. <laughs> Christmas is coming early this year. at it again. The search engine giant announced they will be acquiring yet another startup tech company. This time, it's InstaWheels. Noodle purchased the car sharing startup for $750 million. The startup's future was already threatened by Driver San Francisco. But tech insiders say that with Noodle integrating its search and map functions into the InstaWheels sharing service, it will dominate the marketplace. This is considered a shot across the bow at Noodle competitors such as Invite, who has also been expanding its portfolio of startups.
This is totally ridiculous. Pretty people. Uh, now one thing won't hurt. Of all the stupid ass and I. I'm a smart guy, but I don't get it. Oh, 
shit. Guys, somebody's doxing DedSec members. What? Where? I found a payphone with some hardware attached to it. It just started ringing, and there was a recorded message on the other end. It, it said a few names, Stanley L. something, uh, Sleek Street, Nabil Azari. Awazi. Yep, I know Sleek. Damn, this is a real threat. We need to shut this down fast. Anybody have any ideas? Should we take the hardware? No, leave it for now. I can put together a man-in-the-middle attack to track the other end of the call, but the more we can cover the better. Yeah, I'll see if I can find more hacked payphones. Okay, there's our CEO. I hope he enjoys the workout we're about to give him. Knock him off his cankles. Cardio day.
You get all that? Marcus, that was the most beautiful thing I've experienced today. Sending the video out. The sheer beauty of a douchebag falling on a treadmill could bring peace to the world. <laughs> Since when do you want peace? I mean metaphorical peace. <laughs>